Hi guys. Uh, this one, just a quick video on what you said, Polly, about transitioning to uh, to the verse from the intro. So it's basically you're in four four, and every note you're picking is eighth notes. So the intro is one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four. And, and I don't know what you're doing with your picking hand. You could be doing the thumb 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 thumb. Th thumb 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 finger 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 or as the guy in the video does thumb first second which I find easier and then you're just moving the three fingers after that to the top string so thumb first second then move three fingers to the top string one two three and then your thumb is in the right place for the D string it's a bit clearer isn't it I do that D string and the G string um, but yeah, and then you go to that, so that's your E minor 9 chord, then you swap the fingers around, and you've got your, what's that, E minor 6 chord, basically. And you do the same thing again, picking-wise, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, or 1 and 2, and 3 and 4, and 1 and 2, and 3, and... Is that? Okay, you can tell me if this is clear or not. You can give me feedback on this. Hopefully you can see what my, what my fingers are doing. Now, on the very last uh, time that he's on this E minor, this one where you're, yeah, one, two, three, fourth fret of the A string, second fret of the D string, that's your E minor six. Now, um, the last time he's on that, the the he's basically got open strings on the middle two strings so he goes one and two and three and four and so those last two notes four and he's taking his hand away from the chord and he's getting it ready for the G chord and then he's into yeah Travis picking now I know he does a more complex version of Travis picking on the G chord which I'll address in a coming video but in this one um, and so far, I would say, really, just get that Travis picking so that it's, uh, what's the word, uh, you know, muscle memory, the neural pathways are there, so that you don't have to think about it at all, yeah? You want that Travis picking, you could be on the phone and your fingers are doing this, yeah? You really need it to be that level of practiced, that level of, um, you know, you've taken it on, it's unconscious now, you've learned it so well. So you're here on this last chord, you've got the first one, one and two, one and two and three and four and 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 fingers came away. I'll do that last bit again. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four. And four. So you see that your fingers whether you're doing the intro style of finger picking or the Travis picking that you get onto in the verse, your fingers are picking eighth notes, yeah? It's all one and two, one and one and two and one and two and or one and two and, yeah? And also timing wise, it doesn't have to sag into from the intro to the verse. It doesn't have to be in exactly the same tempo. So if you find yourself one, in the which I often do for some reason, um, the verse. Uh, no, sorry, the intro. I play it slower than the verse, so I. One, and I often like do yeah a little pause um, at the end of the intro, and then go back into. I mean, then go into the verse and then actually speed up the tempo a bit and that's fine so don't worry that oh god I've got to start this in exactly the right tempo because because uh, it actually sounds nice to have those changes of tempo and that's um, artistic license you know you can it doesn't have to be bang on in time um, I mean if you're playing with a band uh, if they follow you very nice if they don't then okay you've got to be in time and you've got to think okay what tempo are we going to be at when I start this well you can work that out but the technical issue of how to transition it's all eighth notes one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and yeah 
So I hope that helps about transitioning.